Alright. Do 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 Now we go on to face Lieutenant Soyge. America! Fuck yeah! Coming again to save the mother flipping day, yeah! <laughs> that song is so stupid. It's stupid but awesome. Um, I was about to say that's the wrong Pokemon for cut, dude. Yeah, I'm not even at the bush yet. Oh, yeah, I am. Insert innuendo here. Smiley face. Vermilion City, Pokemon Gym. I did. Lieutenant the Surge, the Lightning American. He's fought in wars, you know. And here comes the most jerk, the the single whoever designed the mechanic of this gym is a jerk bag. Plain and simple. And you actually have to fight these trainers to get the code too. So. Well, no, it's not code. It's that you have to press like two rand. You have to press a random. Check one of these random trash cans. One of them will have the code. One adjacent to it will have the code. So you have a one in four chance of getting it, and you have a three in four chance of messing it up. If you mess it up, the thing resets, and yeah. That's what save states are for, though. <laughs> <clears throat> I really yeah. want to teach someone dig at this point. Where wit I don't know one of my least fit. Where Whitney was one of my least favorite gym leaders, this has to be one of my least favorite gym designs. Um, of the three that are going to stick around, who should have Dig, you think? Um, who should have Dig? Pikachu's I mean, got... I mean, Pikachu's with got... Is, or, with Charmeleon, he's going to turn into a flying type eventually, so... But then there's the fact yeah. that Pikachu kind of is needs a strong attack. But Ivysaur I'd I'd say honestly that Ivysaur might be a candidate just because oh wait, Ivysaur can't learn dig, can it? I don't think so, no. Um well we can check. Nope. Uh only Charmeleon can learn dig. And actually no, Mew, can, Mew can learn dig. Mew can learn anything. She's insanely versatile and has access to metronome and transform. Can I ask a question? Yes. Why do you always refer to it to Mew as she? Because Mew is the mother of Mewtwo. In the game con in the game continuity, she gave birth. Alright. Mewtwo is her son. Okay, so. Charmeleon it is, then. Although there is something interesting, and I'm not sure if you knew this already. Tell me. There, some people some people speculate that Ditto is a failed clone of Mew. That would make sense to me. That really would. Because they have the same weight. They both are the only Pokemon that can learn and transform through level up. They're the same color in both normal and shiny versions. And the places where you encounter Ditto are linked to both Mew and Mewtwo, being the Pokemon Mansion and Cerulean Gym. And Cerulean Gym, what the hell am I saying? If Cerulean K. She'd never leave. She would just roll everyone over. I was about to say. Yeah, that would have stopped Ash right about then if she had Mewtwo. Yeah, that's the fun part of Dig. First turn, you become invulnerable to everything, even Swift. Second turn, and you hit hard with a ground type move. That actually is. And this is. Watch your. This is before they change it so that Earthquake does a lot more damage to things that are using Dig. In this game, Dig cannot be affected by Earthquake. I think they added that in general. No, it was either Gen 2 or Gen 3, I can't remember. Because I do know that Thunder has 100% accuracy against anything using Fly in Gen 2. 
No, that was 100% accuracy in rain. But it can also hit things that are flying high. Oh. Oh, hey! Okay, so you have a 50, one in 50 two chance, chance. Except it's not a 50 50 chance, it's a 100% chance. Because I have save states! Hacks. I didn't even need them, that's the funny Go. part. I'm a lightweight, but I'm good with electricity. Lightweight. This is a new NPC trainer. The Rocker. Insert. Dragon Force joke here. Yes, if I was an editing genius, I would throw in a, t a five second clip of uh, the intro for Through the Fire and the Flames. But not only am I not but... an editing genius, I'm not crazy. Uh, I am, though. <laughs> And I think I lost man points for doing that. Kind of, yeah. Ooh, a level! Level up! Do 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 Or if you're playing Fire Emblem, do 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 Depending on... Hooray, it's another Vault Orb. Gee, we haven't already seen these. Mankey's going to make quick work. Oh, for the love of Christmas, stop with the Sonic Booms. Sonic Boom does fixed damage. It, uh, hits for 20 HP every single hit. Another fixed damage move is Dragon Rage, which is one of the signature moves of Guy Ritchie. It does 40 damage per hit. Both moves are banned in the Petite Cup and Little Cup of the Stadium Games. For good reason. Wait, they're not banned. I have seen an, an opponent using Sonic Boom at least. Oh wait, no, no, wait, that wasn't it. I'm just glad that. Again, speaking of Little Cup, I am under the idea that Pichu ruined Pikachu's life. How so? Because if Pikachu. If P okay, look at Pikachu's stats. They're pretty good. If he if Pikachu was in Little Cup, it he would still be basically really high up just because he's a powerful electric type with a wicked amount of speed. When Pichu came along, Pikachu could no longer fill that void because he technically was an evolved Pokemon. Was thrown out with the rest of the hard hitters like Scizor and... Quagsire, and he didn't stand a chance, even compared to his own evolved form. Fried. <laughs> that, his, his wife divorced him, he lost the kids. So yeah, Pichu ruined Pikachu's life. End of story. One thing I don't get is why people use Charizard even today. Like Zero pointed out, Stealth Rock is really... Stealth Rock should be banned. There's actually another Pokemon that takes quad damage from it. It's a Fire Bug type. Because, um, Bug is another type that's vulnerable to Rock. Yeah. There's actually a Bug Fire type in Gen 5. Ironically, despite the fact that everyone thought it would be a piece of crap, it is one of the best- Oh, come on! Oh, wow, that's just shit-tastic. He lived! <laughs> well, Voltorb don't have that high an attack stat. Even with the defense-having effect it has in this gen, it still isn't completely de devastating. I mean, it's possible to survive it from, like, a Magnemite. It came from, like, came from Snorlax, you'd be screwed, but from a Magnemite or a Magnemite? What the heck am I saying? Electrode. Yeah, Electrode's more about speed and special attack. It's a glass cannon. Yeah. That's kind of why it has uh, self-destruct and explosion in the first place. Even in special attack, it doesn't work all that well. Alright, everyone's kind of beat up, so... 
Fun fact, I actually have a move called Beat Up in Gen 4. Now I'm just making a bunch of references to gins that have not happened as of this game. Yeah, and Beat Up, but yeah, if, I think Beat Up was in Gen 2. Actually. No. Was, was it? There, there was a move that I believe Sneasel could learn. That, uh... Oh, yeah! It could learn Beat Up in previous gens. It's just that in Gen 4, more Pokemon could get, and that was the first time I saw it. So I immediately assumed it was a new move. What yeah. the? Your Avast needs updating, buddy. Yeah, I... Now that's just because it's not linking up to the update servers unless I do it manually. I probably need to reinstall the program. Oh, what ticket, what the here. hell? What? How's it that my the thing that you have Waffles General Chat has 59 on mine, but it has 20? No, it has 59 on yours and 29 on mine. I don't get that. Because I've probably not been looking at it for very long. Oh right. Yeah, Skype tape sure. keeps track of all the messages that have occurred while you have not been looking at the window. The thing is, I've been checking my... I check my Skype a lot more than Watcher does. Like, in the fact that I'm on the West Coast and it's far... and it's really far away. I'm glad they changed... Uh, never mind. Nope, there. there's a... Treasure. Crammed full of Pokemon books! Looks like he has a mohawk. Like, look at him. Turn hut! Welcome to Vermillion Gym. You look at that, a pint-sized challenger. <laughs> you got big and breasty. That's what your girlfriend said. Uh. Okay, I'm sorry. A Pokemon battle is war. I'll shock you into surrender. Yeah, um, it's confirmed that he did his he and his Raichu. Um, and this is the super leveled Raichu from the anime, mind you. Which Adam nearly oh won crap! Shot they made that ch they made that change for this game. That's mercy. Yeah, I remember the Raichu from the anime. Yeah. Adam, when he played that the game, one... nearly one-shot the darn thing with Pikachu using Mega Punch. I, no, I bet that, think that thing... Let Charmian get a second shot off. <laughs> <laughs> Excuse me while I laugh like a supervillain, ladies and gentlemen. Jeez, you're so evil, Watcher. You really are. You can tell the sarcasm from my voice. And we get the Thunder Badge. Brings up a Pokemon speed. Lets you fly anytime here. Kid, take this. Thunderbolt. Oh, you get it. Pikachu can learn it on his own in this generation. In uh, in this game, rather. But why not? Let's give it to him early. Wobbuffet. And yeah, <laughs> anytime you use a HM or a TM, Mew will always be able to learn it. It's part of her uh, versatility as the genetic progenitor of all Pokemon. Yeah. One thing I hope is that I didn't come across as too loud to drown out you your commentary on this, or. Nah, no, I've got mic boost on now at 20 decibels, so, uh, I gotta... Oh, I gotta... it sounds like it's a lot less than that, but... You probably have but... Skype turned down, that's why. Anyway, Thundershot yeah, is gone. Yeah, Skype turned And... Learn to move, it can learn naturally at a decent level. Ah, oh, well. Well, he's the only one that can learn it out of the final team, anyway. Oh, right. What is your final team, by the way? Um, Red's team and Heart Gold Soul Soul. So, Charizard, Snorlax, Blastoise, Venusaur, Lapras. Was that six? Yeah, it was. Yeah, it's, an it's only a shame you couldn't have Espeon instead of freaking Lapras. Because don't get me wrong, Lapras is a good Pokemon, but Espeon, in my opinion, is better. But, I digress. And so ends the Toa saga of this Let's Play. Yeah, the Vermilion segment is over. 
Now, we, we, get if back we to easily City. want. We can get back to Cerulean City one of two ways. We could go back up north, or we could go through Diglett's Cave. I'm planning to go through Diglett's Cave and catch a Diglett. So I really here. wanted to actually. In reality, I wanted to join this because I thought you were going to go through Diglett's Cave first. Because there's this funny comic I saw that I actually want to bring up. I'll take your squirrel. Oh. Oh, that's right. I As have to. It. I have to deposit a Pokemon. Get rid of that Mankey. You don't need for anything. Yeah. Well, his low kick is useful for picking uh picking off normal types, but. Yeah, but at this point, water type. Bo I need to change boxes. You only have like one Pokemon in that box. No, I have a bunch in box one. I've been catching stuff did... off camera. Oh, okay. So either Pidgeotto or Mankey. Besides, at this point in the game, at this point in the anime, Mankey didn't even have Mankey. He had already put Mankey away. So. Oops. Keep, I keep so, pressing the buttons to make the dialogue boxes go faster. Alright. This, Squirrel. I believe. Oh, for the love of Christ. Where the hell did you get a jinx? Oops, sorry. Normally you're supposed to be able to trade for it, but that trade is not available in this version, so I just caught one. Okay. Well, Again, I. You cannot trade on an emulator, so. Oh, yes. Yeah, so Give Squirtle something nice to start. I do believe this is the end of the Toa saga of this Let's Play. I only regret that I wasn't able to do Diglett's Cave because I found a really... It's sort of perverted, sort of uh, amusing comic revolving around Diglett. I'll probably comment with the link. So, I do believe this is it. Thank you for having me, Watcher. There might be some uh, on the Pokemon Crystal run. I mean, twice the two regions, twice the slots. But for now, I need to level Squirtle up before I go in here and catch some stuff off of the routes that I've uh, passed by. So I will see you guys again very soon. The way the track is going, everyone. we might actually see you again tomorrow. <laughs> Me? Or... No, um, them. I've been doing oh, this segment wow. every day. <laughs> Jer, duh, zer. All well, right. Good night, later, folks. Pe Say goodbye, Toa. Bye. So long. Happy hunting.